So, Zach, uh, what did you think of the kicks? I am excited about it. Thanks for letting me take the test drive on it. Want to make a deal with you? Get in and out. Not a problem. Let's go over a few things first. Uh, I'm sure you're well aware today that, that there's a little bit of a shortage of cars between the chip shortage and, and there was an earthquake in Japan and production has been delayed and, and just not, not able to produce cars in the numbers they like. So... Um, this is one of the few stock vehicles that we have, on, and what we do on all of our stock vehicles is, well, we've added some some accessories to the vehicle already. As you know, the uh, MSRP on the car is $25,135. So one of the items we added was the Clear Pro door protection. It's a, a clear plastic protection. It, it covers the entire door edge guards, the door edges. It, it protects it in case you open it into a cinder block wall or another car. It, you won't get any scratches or chips there. There's uh, finger cups for where your fingers go in to pull up the door handle. No scratches there. Um, so we've added that to the car. That's $995. The Spartan GPS system. I don't know if you're familiar with it, but this this is a, a, a it's it's similar to LoJack, except the big difference is hmm. that we there's actually an app for this, and and you can actually download the app onto your phone, and um, you'll always be able to know, like, let's say your girlfriend takes your car somewhere, you could go on your phone and you could track exactly where she is. So Now I I'm mean, interested. Yeah, so um, that's uh, that's $995. Okay. We've also added the Seattle Jet uh, paint protection. This is a ceramic-based aviation-grade paint protection. I mean, I, I know that, you know, we're talking about years and years down the road that they'll be flying cars. Well, your car may never be a flying car, but it will be protected as if it was. So even if you're uh, attempting to break the land speed record, it's protected. I mean, I, as ridiculous as it sounds, no, but it's helped. protected. What's well, uh, that, a cool 999? That's, uh, that's just 450 bucks. That seems like a deal. Oh, it, it really is. If you're like me and you need to know about EVs, tune into our new show on YAA Electric, plugged in Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. We have the theft code protection. It's an edge that goes on all the windows and everything. Um, really comes in handy if your vehicle gets stolen. It'll help the police in recovering, possibly sure. recovering the vehicle. That's only three hundred ninety-eight. It's a lot of accessories you guys add to the cars here. What can I tell you? Uh, you know, there's we. You know, we only have a handful of cars that we get to do this to. <laughs> uh, wheel locks. Um, because you don't want to, you don't want to come out one morning and find your car sitting on cinder blocks, because uh, somebody thought and admired the alloy wheels that were on the vehicle. So uh, the car's equipped with wheel locks. That's only one hundred and fifty nine dollars. You'll have the, you'll get two keys for it. One, I would suggest you keep it in your glove box and. I don't get, care where you put the other. And then the other thing is we have a uh, we have a market adjustment because of what the is shortage. a market adjustment? Well, when there's a shortage of vehicles, uh, you know, oftentimes um, we adjust the price on the cars that we have um, because of that shortage. And well, that's five thousand dollars. Five thousand uh, dollars. It, it is what it is. Well, how about this? How about yeah. this? Yes. Can I call you Ray? I, I would prefer that you do. Ray, can I see an out the door price? I think that's what's going to help me really understand what I'm working with here because sure. you said the MSRP, yeah. 25 something. I don't even know the math on all the accessories that you just added. Then you said 5000 So I know I'm at least $30,000 and that's out the door. Well, $33,132 is the, is the uh, price of the car with all the dealer installed accessories. So, so let me see that. Let me see that item. Okay. So, well, uh, Honestly, what you're looking at is you have to add about 10% to that. So it's you're going to add roughly $3,300 to that. Your, your out the door is going to be somewhere in the neighborhood of about $36,000. That would work for you, wouldn't it? On a $25,000 car? Well, there there is a shortage of cars today, Zach. So let me see the out the door. I want to I want to take a quick peek because I think if I'm not mistaken, when when, when I spoke to your internet yes, rep, yes. they said that you know the, the things are negotiable. We can talk about yeah, it. Yeah. I know you've been sitting on this kicks for a little while. I, I checked that out. You've had it yeah. for a couple weeks now. Yeah. I'd love to get it off your hands. How about we drop the market adjustment? Okay. And we can talk about the accessories. If if let me ask you a question. If we drop the market adjustment, hmm. uh, I'm not saying we can, but if we did. 
would you buy the car today? Would you take it home with you today? Would you sign it and, uh, and uh, sign up for it and, and, and drive home with it? I'm here at the dealership. You know, uh, I'm, that I'm didn't interested. answer my question. If if we were to drop the market adjustment, okay, that's five thousand dollars right there. If I save you five thousand dollars right there, are you prepared to complete the transaction right now? Let me ask you a question, right? Certainly. Are you really saving me five thousand dollars when the five thousand dollars you added is fake? If you're not paying it, you're saving it. I am. I am here. Yeah. I am a local citizen. Yeah. I would love to build a relationship with your dealership. I would love for that to happen. I am not. Our goal, just so you know. Yeah. If I may, Zach, just just so you, our goal here at Gotcha Motors, we don't want to just sell you one car. Okay. We want to sell you a lot of cars. Isn't your slogan? If, One time if, if we got you. If somebody now we got you if, if somebody doesn't get you, got your motors <laughs> well. That's our slogan. Listen, I understand you're local, and I understand that our business is is based on having local customers and, and selling them more than one car. So Building relationships. It, that's what it's all about. If I if I can't connect with you, then you're never buying a car from me. And so I, I want to try and treat you right, if I may. Thank you. I've knocked off that $5,000. I, I, I told my boss, you know, come on, make it on the next guy. We don't need to make it on Zach. We don't need to make it on everybody. And I also got the boss to agree to reduce the prices on the dealer installed accessories. I told you I'd pay cost. I appreciate you thinking Well, me. so I, I'm able to get you the Seattle Jet for two fifty five. dollars So it's uh, saved you $195 on that. That Spartan GPS. That was a thousand dollars. Not anymore. Yet. It's another two fifty five. Okay, that sounds better. Okay, now the Clear Guard, which was nine ninety five, I could only get them to mark that down to five ninety nine. And the uh, Etch, that's that's still the three ninety eight. But I mean, I've saved you. Uh, Seven hundred, uh, probably over a thousand bucks. But now you discounted uh, the selling price from MSRP by a couple thousand. Uh, the selling price is the MSRP. I took off the market adjustment. Okay, um, I can't do both. Zach, they, they taught me a long time ago. I, I should I should really only share with the customer what I can do. I should never tell you what I can't do. Yeah. What I can do. What I can do, Zach. Uh, I was able to get that five thousand dollar market adjustment knocked off. I can get you the car for the twenty five one thirty five, and an additional fifteen hundred and seven dollars for the accessories that were that were twenty eight hundred bucks. So I I saved you fourteen hundred dollars in total. I've saved you sixty four hundred dollars off of what we were asking for the car. That's what I can do for you. Well, I, will that work for you, Zach? You're a good guy. I'm trying. You got a good. You got a good. This. Your eyes are also quite beautiful. Well, thank you. Here's the deal. Yeah. I'm gonna sleep on it. Just, uh, just, just, just out of curiosity, Zach. What is there to sleep on? Well, I've never bought a car at MSRP. I didn't first ask for, for any of these accessories. There's a first time for everything. You're making me feel good, which yeah. I appreciate. Yeah. But I'm a little concerned that it might be impulsive for me to make this decision right now, especially when I think I know you can go lower. How long have you been thinking about the car? Uh, I don't need a car. I, I didn't, just want I a didn't car. ask you if you need a car. How long have you been thinking about this car? It's not a question of need. How long have you been thinking about it? Uh, maybe a couple weeks. Okay. So it's not like you haven't given it thought. Did you do some research online? Uh, JoinYAA.com, Okay. Yeah. So you, you, you have an idea. I mean, you know, you, you, you don't do the research. You don't invest the time that you've invested online if you, if you really weren't looking to move forward and get a, yeah, get a you're car. So, yeah. so you're here now. If I may say, I, I just, there, there's just between you and me, okay? There's three letters that mean everything to us in the car business, okay? Three letters. N O W, three letters. Here's the deal. Yeah, I didn't ask for any of those accessories. Well, I, no, I, I will it. take this off your. Life. I will yeah. go spend an hour with your F and I manager, and I will, in, I will, I will consider every single extended warranty. Get, I'll, I'll think about it all yeah. with your F and I manager. Yeah. Yeah. Right now, you got me out the door at twenty nine thousand seven hundred sixteen dollars and a few pennies. Twenty eight five. 
Get okay. me out the door at 25. So, so let me let me ask you a question, sir. We're asking 29.7. Mm -hmm. You want to be at 28.5. 28.5. How much more can you go up from 28.5? And I'll try and come down from 29.7. And, and we'll try and meet here in the middle, which is what I would call nirvana. What would that number look like to you? 28.7. No, really, Zach. 28.7. I'll sign the paperwork right now, 28.7. Okay, I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll, I'll, I'll get that marked down to 29.7 even. Okay? I'll take sixteen dollars <laughs> and five steps. So, so seriously, Zach, you, you you can't say to me when we're twelve hundred dollars apart. Hey, I'll give you two hundred bucks. Okay. So other than twenty eight seven, other don't and don't and don't look at me and go. Okay, Ray, I'll go. I'll go twenty eight nine. It, you know twenty nine even. Tw so if, if you're saying if I if I get this to twenty nine even. Yep, I'm out the door. If I get that to 29 even, you're buying the car. I'll, I'll, right now. Okay, do me a favor. Put your initials there, that you'll buy the car. You'll take it to your sales manager? I'll take it to my sales manager. I don't want, I don't want to be using my initials because he's going to think I'm doing it for you. So if I get you the $29,000 out the door, you're going home in your new car. Can't wait. Okay, I'll be back in a minute. This is a deal yeah. from Eddie in our community. Yes. He ended up getting out the door at 28.7, I think. Something like that. Yeah. yeah. And he probably went through a bunch more crap than I just had to go through right there. Well, yeah. I mean, I'm trying to give you the abbreviated portion. And so I think this is a perfect example of what you can expect. Yeah. You are so good. <laughs> yeah. You are so good at that because you did it for so long. But that, man, we, we maybe we'll make a separate video yeah. where we just do play-by-play. -play. Because you could pause every 10 seconds I, and you are taking control every step of the way. Yes, I am. It's yeah. incredible. I, I'll never forget, I, I, I took a turn at the Pontiac store and, and I was giving a guy like $3,800 for his van. And he said, hey, I know it's worth more than that. I go, I go, well, how much more does it have to be worth? And don't be telling me it's got to be like $4,300 because that ain't never happening. Uh, that was the number I knew the guy wanted, but I took it away yeah, took before it away, he could yeah. even ask for it. He goes, well, can you get me somewhere around four, 4,100 maybe? If I can get you the 4,100, I was probably prepared to go to the 45. <laughs> but that, that, that's called negotiating. Comment down below what you want to see us do next. Humbling is the word that I'll use to describe this. Eddie, huge congrats to Eddie. Read his story in the community. He did a hell of a job. Yeah, see the problem is for customers, they do this every four or five, six years. Managers do this five, eight, ten times a day. They get pretty smooth at it. Yeah, they really do. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Pops. Thank you.